Good day to all of you. Well, my name is Scott Piggin. To all you lemonade days out there, I really want to share with you, I'm here on the Great Wall of China, one of the eight, ma eight made wonders of the world, eight man-made wonders of the world. And I actually just found out today that I was born in the Year of the Dragon. And the Year of the Dragon is about power and prosperity. And I thought, what a better place than one of the eight man-made wonders of the world. This thing was built in 700 BC the first time. It was built in 10 years, took a million men, which was 20% of the entire Chinese population, and over 500,000 of them died. It was then built a second time where they built a second wall, and then a third time in the 1400s where it was built out of brick, just like this. And we stand grand challenges, like trying to build this wall. Many thousands of people died, and yet when they built it again in the 1400s, it took over 100 years to build it. Six thousand kilometers long but they had a vision they had a dream they had a need they knew what their why was and their why was to stop people from the outer regions coming and invading their cities and in South Africa and Africa we've got the same challenges in fact we've got massive challenges we've got challenges of, of the schooling systems not working we've got challenges of technology or, or more importantly education not being able to get out to the children we've got 10 unemployed disenchanted youth just in South Africa alone that cannot get jobs and there's only one way that we are going to solve that problem and that is by educating and empowering the youth with the education of entrepreneurship and that is what Lemon Day Day is all about. Literally out there in America, they're empowering a man by the name of Michael Holthaus. Had a dream. And now, eight years later, he's got Google for Entrepreneurs and supporting him. 250,000 children are given an incredible opportunity every single year. They learn about two things. They learn about self-respect and they learn about how to make one rand, one dollar, one euro. Because once you've got that, nothing can control you. No school, no university, no country. You truly can have the life or your children can have the life that they dream of. And so I implore all of you, every single person in South Africa, to step up, to be part of the solution. You know, we've just got it off the ground there in, in South Africa with the support of America. And we did our first one. We empowered 45 children. They, every single one of them made money. And little Bongani out of the townships made over 1,400 rand profit. That's more money than his parents earn in a month. It's more money than he's ever seen cash in his life. And I guarantee you that just like this great wall of China, we have changed that man's life and he will be a great, great citizen of South Africa. One that will bring and give back to our country. And maybe he might be a great emperor that can inspire a nation to build an entire great wall like this. Maybe he'll be the next Elon Musk or Tokyo Sesquali. But that's our challenge, ladies and gentlemen. And so with this dragon, we need to think of power and prosperity. We need to think of solutions. We need to stop complaining about the problems, but be part of the solution. And so I ask you to get on board. I ask you to come on board as a mentor. I ask you to enable it, to drive it, to inspire children, because it is our greatest hope for a great country. It is our greatest hope for a great continent. And I truly believe that the future is Asia and Africa. Let's empower and love the place that we live. Let's embrace the place that we live. And you know, really, this great wall was built as the Silk Road between the trade between East and West. And Africa, India and Asia is the future, ladies and gentlemen. It's over three billion people or, or literally half the global planet. Let's empower the kids and we will have a phenomenal century ahead of us. So if I leave you with this great wall of China, we have a great challenge ahead of us. But where there's the will and where there's the mind, you will make it happen. Whether it's for you, for your children or for others, I inspire you to go out there. Be part of the solution of South Africa. Empower the children of South Africa and ultimately Africa. And we will create a great country and a great continent. That is your challenge. Cheers.